Ace is the place with the helpful hardware, folks. Installing a programmable thermostat is usually so simple that setting your new thermostat will probably take more time than hooking it up. And there's plenty of reason to do it. Now you can lower your energy bills by cutting back heating and cooling when you're not at home. And you can update to a thermostat that's easier to program or has more options to adjust to your schedule. Now first thing is to turn off the main power to the heating and cooling unit. The thermostat wiring is low voltage, but you can still get a shock. Remove the old thermostat cover. Now you're going to see wires that connect to tiny screws called terminals, which are lettered. Write down the wire color and the terminals they connect to. Some brands make this easier by including stickers to label the wires with. Now it's common to see four wires if you have a single stage air conditioner and heater. Now if it's wired correctly, the wire color will match the letter on the terminal. G for the green wire, it controls the fan. Y for yellow, it connects to the cooling. W for white goes to the heating. R for red, it's the power to the thermostat and feeds the other wires. Now if you see RC and RH initials, think red cooling and red heating. Loosen the terminals to detach the wires and remove the old thermostat. To keep the wires from slipping back into the wall, wind them around a pencil or tape them. You want 3 eighths of an inch of bare wire at the ends. If you need to trim the wire, use a wire stripper to cut the sheath, but leave the wire intact. Slip the wire bundle through the base plate of the new thermostat. Hang up the base plate now so there's less to juggle when you connect the wires. To connect the wire to the terminals, slide the bare tip into the slots that match up with your wires. Make sure they're all the way in and tighten the screws. Then install the batteries in the base plate and snap on the cover. You're ready to turn the power back on and set up the programming. Here are a few tips to help you out. Look for an armchair programmable thermostat. You can remove the faceplate, take it to another room, and program it while you're sitting down. To save energy in the winter, you can lower the temps when the house is empty, you're bundled up under the covers, or when no one is home. But don't change it more than 8 degrees, because you'll use too much energy to get the house back up to temperature. And the same is true when programming your air conditioning. Now if your wiring is more complicated than the basics we showed you, it could mean a few things. You have a two-stage system. Your air conditioner and heater were installed at different times. You have a heat pump. Or you have hot water heating. Check the product instructions. They often contain a website or helpline for assistance. Manufacturer specific advice can also help you with programming the new thermostat. Now if you're not sure how to connect the new unit, it's time to contact a licensed HVAC professional. For the tips, advice, and tools you need, visit your neighborhood ACE. And find us online at acehardware.com. ACE is the place with the helpful hardware, folks.